Okay, so this is me fourth entrance to Lady Street. Uh, third time today. I'm gonna try and explain what I've got. There's a, a deafening DVD shop there on the right, and then obviously a fruit market next to it. Uh, on the left, this is apparently Gourmet Alley, but it doesn't seem to be very gourmet today. At least most of it's closed down. Uh, there's a couple of food places. Apologies for those of you not based in Newcastle, because the comparisons I make are going to be uh, fairly specific to there. But over here on the right, upstairs, you've basically got the equivalent to Dobby's Garden Centre. Uh, with the pet stores and fish stores and obviously a load of plants. That's, that's slight a uh, flower market. Um, downstairs here, which we'll have a walk into, is something similar. If you imagine the uh, clothes stores in the Granger market to the power of about 500. It's just absolutely packed full of, yeah, crazy clothes stores. That's a, I think that's a boot shop over there at the left. There's about 25 different nail bars. Uh, jewelry shop over there. Let's have a look. Yeah, so this is heading down next to the clothes. Uh, there's a stall over here that sells ladies' trout bras. Close enough for me. Um, and what I'm trying to find is a second-hand mobile phone store that two current guidebooks have told me is in here somewhere. But I'm absolutely ruined if I can find it. I've been in here a load of times and it's just not here at all. Uh, so, yeah, I've found the the garden centre, I found the clothes shop, I found a trinkets market, uh, a wicker furniture store including lamps and other porcelain goods, uh, there's a equivalent of a American sports discount store, um, there's absolutely all sorts but I just can't find this electrical store anywhere and all of this is about in the space of Monument Mall. It's the most curious selection of, of goods you've ever seen. Let's see if we can zoom in there. Fashion Veranda, Foreign Trade Avenue, Back Street, maybe the boys are there, uh, Korea Avenue and Underwear. But this mobile phone shop is just eluding me. Is that it up there? I don't think so. That looks like bags to me, but let's go and check it out. I haven't been up there yet. There's supposed to be three floors of second-hand electronics though, so I don't know where the hell they're hiding it. 